Hey guys, we're going to be opening another box of Champions of Asia today. Um, I think the last box we got the pacing a little bit wrong. I think it was a bit of a longer video than what it needed to be. So there's still a few bits I need from the set, so I just thought we'd do another one. And similarly, um, just go for each pack, but with a bit more of a pace this time. So still a pretty funky dunky set. Um, Uh, oh, yes, show it to the camera, show it to the camera. So that is actually one of the triples I needed. So that is really cool. That's the rune shade right there. So obviously with these, if you don't know, it's 12 packs per box and it's another chappy. God. Wait, was there only one rare in that? Oh no, it was the, yeah, that was the guy, whatever he's called. The, Dimension Police guy as well. Yeah, like I said, um, 12 packs per box. Uh, same as before with the two rares uh, guaranteed and then one potentially being higher. Oh, we've got a Diamond Ace. So this is the perfect guard um, draw trigger for, can we get a focus on that? Yeah, for uh, Dimension Police. And we've got a Die Dragon, which is our second triple rare. Uh, I've really just never had any interest at all in Deep Place, really. A few times I have played him, just not got along with him. But I must say, Ground Blade is a really fun deck. It's one of my uh, good friends. It was his first deck. And we've got the first ever rare. Well, I think I might think that's the first ever rare. It's a Miracle Beauty with the Cutlass there. But I remember playing Night Rose in the G um, format. That was a lot of fun. Except for I went to a Nationals and Mirror Match over there. Uh, Gus Jin, perfect guard. So unfortunately we, we are very much maxed out on him, but he's a, still a cool card. And someone will need him. So it's another double rare pack. That's the uh, rare Sentinel for Eclipse and Blue Blood, who's originally the uh, Grand Blue uh, 10k. It is cool when you recognise sort of the old school units and seeing them with their retrains. Oh, we've got a Maelstrom. He's not quite the VR we wanted. Uh, obviously one of the Buskirk. But, someone will trade it for this. It looks really cool. Um, I'm not a fan of the yellow in the background of this card. But nonetheless, pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, it's just two reds in that one. So unfortunately, I think with these sets, you the VR takes away your chance to get an OR or anything else in terms of higher than triple rare. Uh, so we got a Commander Laurel double. Pretty think I remember he plummeted in value the original. One. Yes, it's the grade two. Would you to be honest? There's a uh, double ref for uh, Akros, the Viviana. Is that last pack? Yeah. Oh, I didn't realize we'd already gone for it. That was... That's right. Yeah, but I think uh, with these small boxes, they are only 12 packs. The videos do only need to be about three or four minutes. Um, so, those are the pulls. Um, like I say, pretty decent haul. Um, and one step closer towards completing a couple of decks. Uh, so please be watching out because we're going to have some more boxes uploaded, like I say, deck profiles and all that good stuff. So thank you for watching and see you in the next video.